So it just leads me to my next question. And you kind of touched upon it a little bit earlier. Like, so what makes you unique? Like, you know, obviously, you know, you have a certain set of skills and I wanted you to highlight that. Well, uh, I, I think that uh, I, I have a combination of experience um, and it's kind of unique experience. Um, you know, I'm not, I'm not terribly old, I don't think. Sometimes, sometimes I feel older than others. I'm older, older than you, uh, but um, you know, I've been for as for as old as I am, I've done a lot of this, um, and I've I've been experienced in that. And uh, for what I do, uh, I think I present a real value proposition uh, in a, in a couple of ways, which is one, uh, while my billable rate is not cheap, it is I'm against attorneys all all day long who will charge you know, 50 to 75% more than me for the same level of service. I keep up, you know, obviously I, I think I compare favorably with, you know, a lot of attorneys who are charging a whole lot more and who aren't as cognizant of their time. And that kind of ties back to the point I made earlier, which is one thing I think I'm particularly good at is being able to manage a case in a way that is appropriate for what that case is. Because in what I tell clients, I don't want you coming back to me in two, three months, holding up a huge bill and say, Eric, what happened? You know, I want you to, that's why I have the conversations with them early on and why I try to manage it so well throughout the litigation so that it doesn't go as nuts as it could and try to keep things involved. So I think that um, it's really that combination of skill, experience and value, I think that that makes me different. 